This is totally not planned. It's Sunday afternoon. It's five o'clock. It's still super bright thanks to daylight savings, hun. And I've been out all day. I went out for breakfast this morning. Well, it was kind of like brunch with my partner and some of our friends. And then I went to the bookstore to buy my niece a Christmas present, which I'll show you. She's getting into reading. So I bought her this really beautiful hardback. It's a classic, Beauty and the Beast. So this is her Christmas present for me. Um, it's absolutely freaking stunning. Stunning. So that's what I got for my niece for Christmas. Anyway, what are we doing today? I'm going to start reorganizing my bookshelf. This is not a bookshelf tour. That will come soon, probably in the new year. Around January, I will go through my book collection and show you every single book and give you guys a bookshelf tour. But right now, I want to reorganize it and I thought I'd film some of it. I get tons of like compliments I guess on my bookshelf especially on Instagram that's where I show it off the most when I am on YouTube I don't really film in front of it um, because I like simple backgrounds so you can focus on me and the books that I'm talking about but I'm really oily like I've got like BB cream on and shit and I'm just oily as anyway um yeah, I get tons of compliments about my bookshelf, so I thought I'd organize it and show you guys how I do it. I have a very particular way of organizing my bookshelf. I need it to be pleasing to my eyeballs. When I look at it, I don't want to be overwhelmed. I want to look at it and appreciate it for what it is, and that is pure fucking beauty. All right, let's freaking organize this and change it up because there's a lot of black as you can see, and it's kind of all in one spot. I want to break it up a little bit. Let's see how I go. <laughs> I don't know how I'm going to do this. I don't know if I'm just going to fucking play music over this. This is going to be two days of filming because I cannot organize this in a few hours and I'm really tired right now. Um, but yeah, all my mafia is on, in one spot and I don't want it there. I love this stack and this stack will stay where it is. So this is my colourful stack, and it's Kennedy Ryan and Brittany C. Terry. They're books that I own. I don't have Flow, which is a part of the group uh, trilogy. I don't have that at the moment on my bookshelf because it's next to my bed because I'm reading it. Um, but I really do like how that how that's sitting, like just that stack there. I don't know about this stack. I know I want to fucking move all this. Let's just pull it all down, and then we'll go from there. All right, so I want to lighten up some of this space, especially the center, because there's a lot of dark. So I'm going to move some of my series around. Um, so I've got the Addicted series here, uh, which I haven't finished reading. I will get around to it. Um, I'm hoping to get back into reading this next year um, so I can finally film my review video, which is already kind of halfway filmed. Um, yes, yeah, so I've read the first and that half of the second, but I haven't read the rest. But I want to, as I said, bring some lightness back to this area. So I'm going to do that. I always like to store my books like on the side and not necessarily across the whole shelf like that. Um, and put them on an angle. It just looks more appealing. It doesn't look cluttered. And I know it takes up more space doing that, but it just looks better. Oh, I should really dust it too, hey. I like that. I'm just them a little bit so they're like that. I hate that that book is damaged. Oh my god. Okay. And then I put the Callaway. So maybe I can put that in the center. These books here, the spin off of the Addicted series, the Callaway Sister series. Weirdest covers ever. Okay, so that's there. What else can I put there? That's light. Actually, I think I've changed my mind already. I think I've changed my mind already. I think I want to put them up. <laughs> Honestly, this is just one shelf. Put that up. Yeah, into that corner. Move them. So they're there. They don't match though. 
And then I'm going to move, you can't really see, but I've got my Al Kennedy books here. And I think I'm gonna move them up here. Just because they kind of go together. And then I've got the pocket size of the off campus, which isn't my favorite, but and maybe I could go like that. Oh, I don't know guys. What does that look like on camera? Hmm. No, I don't like it. Mm -mm, I don't like that. I don't like that at all. Well, this is going to be interesting, isn't it? Take them off. Oh, they'd look cute like that if I had a plant. Oh, no. They can go down here. Right. I think I can do this. I know I've got a stack like that. Oh. Like that. And put them on top. Will they fit? Oh, they don't even fit. I know this isn't going to plan. Maybe like that. No, I don't like it. I don't like it like that. Mm -mm. Maybe I'm thinking I'll put them in the center. Oh, that makes sense. I'll do that. Yes, I know what to do. I'm going to put the Callaway and the Addicted series where Gianna Darling's books are. Okay. Yes. Okay. So I want all up here to be like the colorful shelf. Then we'll do a black shelf. No. Yes. No. Yes. Okay. I know what to do. I know what to do. Colorful. Black. Colorful. Black. Colourful, black, colourful, black. Oh, yes, yes. And then it'll look all like, mm hmm Okay, so I'm going to move these up there. Yep, I like that already. So it just breaks it up a bit. Oh, that fits perfect too. Oh, it fits perfect as well. Great. Okay, so that's that. So we've got some Ammo Jones. Put her there. Yeah, I think I'm going to do that. I need to buy in silence. She's the greens. All right, let me put them in order. I got the silver swan. We'll go there. Silver Swan, Broken Puppet, Melon Part, One, no, Part One, Part Two, and then we have Santi Diabole, Part One, Part Two. In those two. Mark. See, that looks nice. Doesn't that look nice? I think that looks nice. And then, I love these covers, but the one thing that pisses me off about these books from Ammo is the size difference because they're literally tiny. You'll see there. Like, that's so annoying. Um, and they can go on top. Like so. That's a bit cute, don't you think? Actually, I'm gonna move this, hang on. <laughs> There's that. Move that there. Hmm. Hmm. <gasps> oh. Oh, hang on a minute. One hour later. Update. This shelf isn't going so well. I ended up putting the Biker series from Serena up here. Al Kennedy's books here because it's colourful and it will break it up. I put Amara in the centre. Yes. 
Her books are hard to arrange because they're all different sizes. Amma, if you watch this, hun, we need to work out the sizing of your books. They've all got to line up, honey. Um, I have the same issue with um, uh, Fiona Cole's books. I have the same issues with her. Um, not her as a person, just her sizing of books. Anyway, so we've done that. I've moved the Addicted series because I don't know where I'm going to put her. To be frank, I think I'm literally going to put the way my Mafia books were back here on this shelf. Just because on this side, I've got Mafia as well. Cora's Kimura Chronicles and the books I own from Sophia Lark will go here. I need to flatten that. And then we've got <sighs> Serena's Five Point Mob Collection here. All of the A. Zabarelli Boston Underworld series here. And then I knew that was going to fall. And then these two here. See how that just looks better like that? You see what I mean? So we're colourful, colourful, mafia, mafia, dark, dark, light. This, this one needs to be colourful. Yes, this needs to be colourful. And I've got this random stack of books here. What does that look like? See, I don't mind that. I think that kind of breaks it all up. But then what else do I put there, you know what I mean? Can you see what I'm even doing? And I need a plant there. So we're gonna try and mimic this colorful shelf. This one's literally my favorite because it's just pink, pretty much. So I wanna try and do the same thing here. But I need a pot plant there. Fucking hell. There. See? That looks cute. But then I need to do that. How am I going to do that? What can I stack there that's colourful? Oh, I could actually, because I've got the whole Bridgerton series. Will that throw this whole shelf off though? See, I like the way that that looks. I figured it out guys, don't worry. I know you weren't worried, but I figured it out. I'm gonna put a cold thorn and roses there. Yeah, yeah, I'm gonna put. Why did she have to make this big, this book so big? I haven't read any of these. I'm planning on it in the new year. But then we can put them there. Cause they're colorful. cute don't you I think that looks really cute oh and I could probably take them off and put them there too <gasps> don't you think that looks fucking cute I could even break it up a bit I think that looks really nice so I need to do these little corners over here okay so I think I'm going to move Mr. Masters up the top because it's colorful there and then the addicted series there mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. and then I don't know what I'm gonna do there so let me just do that seriously though tail swans books are fucking massive if you haven't ever read Mafia, start off with this one. This was my first Mafia read, and it's bloody good. It's really good. It's so good. Um, 
It's set in Italy as well, which explains why it's called The Italian. How does that look? Let me step back. Yes, yes, I see, I, I like that. Got the whole Voyeur series right here, baby. My favorite one is Another, which is a surprise pregnancy. But when I read it, I didn't know it was a surprise pregnancy and that's when it's my favorite, okay? I don't wanna know that there's gonna be a pregnancy. The third one to the Blame It on the Alcohol should be coming out soon and I can't wait. Okay. I've just hidden one of her books. See, that looks cute. I like that. That's the first half done. We're going to do the rest of it tomorrow, I think. I think we'll do the rest of it tomorrow because I'm getting a little bit tired. So I'll see you soon.